Okay, I think we're in. It does feel kind of nice to be playing wireless again. <laughs> Alright, but we're in. Cool. So are these servers going to be up unlike Dark Souls? Played the entirety of Dark Souls. We never had any servers. Could Ink is uh, could Ink is with us? Do ah, uh, there's multiplayer. All right, cool. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna ask you real quick before we go in. Is the volume too loud, or is everything sound pretty good? If everything sounds good, we'll just keep going. But I just want to make sure before we get any further. This is very epic music. <laughs> Display blood. Okay, get that on. So one made subtitles. Say what? Eurovision? Say what? Oh. It's a Turkish song that sounds like that sounds like Danish. Great grandmother. Great great grandmother. Look at my crazy okay. I kid you not, that is what it sounds like. Just YouTube, okay. All right, I'm just going to assume the volume's good. <laughs> so let's get in. Prioritize quality or frame rate? Do frame rate. Let's just leave it default. Auto target? Wait, automatically target an enemy when attacking with no lock. I'm not sure if I want that on. I never realized there was a controller vibration strength. Auto target an enemy when attacking with no lock. I, th I think I kind of want that off. Toggle auto lock on. All right, I'll just leave it all on for now. If I don't like it, I'll change it later. That's all. All right, see what we've got. Uh, select a base for creating your character. Okay. So we have Vagabond. <laughs> Vagabond. Uh, warrior. Hero. Bandit. Astrologer. Prophet. This game already looks really good. Uh, <laughs> Samurai. Prisoner, confessor, and <laughs> wretch. Okay. Uh, hmm. I'm afraid to really pull this. I think we're just gonna choose. <laughs> so this looks like like an assassin from Assassin's Creed. But I'm guessing like a white cleric or like a mage or something. Bandit. Warrior. I feel like one of the basic ones I should probably go with. All right, so having just played Dark Souls, I was very good with two-handed weapons. That's how I rolled. So, in a weird way, I kind of want to do like more of a balance character this time. There are classes. There are classes. Yeah, these games got classes. Okay. There's um. At least from my familiarity after having just literally just playing Dark Souls this week. Um, you can be like more dexterity, you can be more strength based, you could be a mage, but you can prioritize in specific type of magics. Like you could be more fire, like a pyromancer or uh, I don't know, something else. <laughs> Other type of mages. <laughs> Can't think of them right now. I didn't really prioritize in the magic. Miracle stuff, you know. Everyone knows. What the hell is this? Uh, I think I'm gonna go... I mean, Confessor actually looks kinda cool. I don't know why. I think I'm gonna go with one of the first three or four. Don't wanna think I wanna go Fingabon. Warrior's kinda cool. Bandits, hero, eh. 
I think last time I went like more of a thief dexterity like bandit type and then I slowly devolved into a warrior. So I feel like these these two are probably more strength based from the looks of them or like tanks kind of like I played last time and then the hero is probably like middle ground. Bandit's probably more like dex based ish. Um, it's kind of stressful. Maybe I'll go bandit. Go type A. Name. Name, what else am I going to be? Current bigger engineer. If my characters fit. All right, there we go. Body type. All right, so there's type. Oh, really? Oh, I thought type A and type B was like male or female. So body type has no bearing on ability. Okay, so either buff body or slender. Sure, we buff. Uh, age only affects appearances, has no bearing on ability. Okay. How do I zoom in? Trigger buttons. Thank you. That was not what I was looking for. <laughs> uh, young, mature, or aged? He will be mature. Oh, I didn't even see the stats there. All right, so there's vigor, mind, endurance, strength, dexterity, intelligence, faith. Okay, it's kind of like a basic Dark Souls stat line. So vigor's probably like health, mind. I don't know what mind it could be. <laughs> Magic stuff. But, excuse me, it's probably more intelligence and faith and arcane. I don't know what mind is. Maybe mind's more like resistance. Oh, well, we'll figure it out later. Uh, Stu Mature. Origin. I'm a bandit. Keepsake. No keepsake. The past has been well and truly left behind. <laughs> nice. Uh, let's see what this do. A medallion laid with crimson amber increases maximum HP. The gold of grace shining in the eyes of the people of the lands behind. Used to gain many ruins. Uh, a golden seed wash ashore from the lands between, said to enhance sacred flask. Oh, that could be good. Uh, ashes of small diminutive golems. Ashes are said to hold spirits within. Three strange cracked pots that somehow mend themselves. A container for certain thrown items. Uh, a two stone key shaped like swords. Breaks the seal of imp statues which can only be used once. Excuse me. Uh, five secret branches charged with beguiling power. Beguiling. Wicked words. Uh, said to originate from the demigod McQuella. McQuella. Go with that. Um, five pieces of boiled brawn. Prawn. <laughs> Boost physical damage negation. I'm realizing I forgot to enable my caption, so I apologize. But let me do that real quick. Okay. That's like two seconds. Um, boiled prawn. Gotcha. Uh, Sabruri's woo. The crazed likeness of a noble whose eyes have been gouged out <laughs> attracts the enemy's aggression. Jesus. All right. Um, I feel like the flask one. Noise. Very nice. Actually, she sounds a lot better now I'm thinking about it, <laughs> volume-wise. Um, I'm thinking... I'm thinking we could go with the Golden Seed. Choose base template, detailed. I kind of just want to keep, like... <laughs> Choose a template, appearance, detailed appearance. Guess we use a plain one first. Uh, what's common? <laughs> Excuse me. Was common face among the tarnished. After all, they were all warriors once. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. The face of an austere pilgrim. There are many roads to truth. Uh, that's that's probably my complexion. <laughs> a regal face found among those who claim noble blood in the lands between. Uh, this is me on the inside. Face found among a proud and seclusive tribe of folk well-versed in ancient legends and heresies alike. Uh, face found among the hardy people of the unforgiving north. Some say they're descended from giants. You can get really role-playing into this, huh? <laughs> Uh, seafarer. Uh, the face of one who wanders the seas in search of their home in the lands between. Uh, a face for the far away. I can uh, stop yelling. I don't know why. A face for the far away, isolated land of reeds where blood is a familiar sight. Uh, wow. Uh, the stony face of the people of the ancient dragons, among whom life is typically short. Uh, the, wow, these people are kind of cool. Uh, the features of those known as night folk. Few in number, they were said to bleed silver long ago. And we got Newman. The face of the Newmans. Post descendants of denizens of another world. Long lived, but seldom born. Are they like <laughs> blood born? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I don't even know where to start. We'll go super pale and just go from there. I can set a voice. Can I test it? I kind of like the grunts from two more than one, I think. <laughs> well, I mean, they can go either way. Okay. I don't think that one. <laughs> I'm guessing the grunts are just all death sounds, basically. <laughs> all right, I think I'm leaning between young voice one and mature voice two. I have to go with that one. Uh, alter skin color. I can be even paler. <laughs> uh, let's go. I would go with that. Am I gonna mess with this too much? Because I know, it's, as far as I know, to my knowledge, it's not super important. But it's also, I mean, it's good to at least create something out of it, right? Inquiry. This is a very detailed uh, character creation, though. I feel like I could just be here for hours and just get lost. <laughs> There's a lot to do here. All right, Nose Ridge. Do you think I want to at least adjust the nose a little bit? Personally? I think I just don't want it slanting as much. That's a little bit better. Make sure the nostrils are nice. <laughs> nostrils are fine. Uh, let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
You know what? I think I want to go with... Oh, it's a kind of one mess with the hair. So let's get the color down. Get some really bright colors. Get like an icy blue. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, we'll go reddish. I do like you can at least adjust the colors a little bit. That's not too bad. I think I still want it. Ooh, yeah, a little bit more like that. So like I still want it like a little bit more on the brownish side, but red. Not Auburn, but I really leave it like that. Luster. Trying to wonder what luster means. Alright. A uh, root darkness? I don't think I can really see the roots of this hairstyle, though. I can kind of see it in the front there. It's not too noticeable. Get some white hair. That's actually kind of nice. I think I want a little bit of white on this, like white hair on this guy. It's like very faint, but I'll go with that. Eyebrows, we can fix that. I'll go with that. Facial hair. We will have a beard on you. <laughs> Even like a super, like chops. <laughs> uh, let's go with more. Let's look at these bottom two. Maybe that one. I mean, it's kind of like basic. Basic, like scruffy beard. See, either I can go with like super scruffy or like semi scruffy. Might just go semi. Yep. Stubble. Give it thick. What's what's a thin stubble look like? Out of curiosity. That's actually kind of cool. You don't see that often. Like you can still have your beard, but make it a little bit thicker, or a little bit thinner, depending on the uh, beard you're using. Don't think it's like super noticeable. I don't think. But it's kind of nice. All right, eyelashes. Uh, let's go. I might just leave them at three. Yeah, I'll just do that. Eyes. I can change the colors of both eyes. So that's kind of cool. Let's go. Some a little bit more greenish. I like that. Why not? I didn't leave it. <laughs> right clouding eye color. I actually don't see anything. Right eye? Oh, it's like my iris. Okay, sorry. Not my iris. My, uh, like the actually outside of the eye. Clouding. I don't see the clouding now. It's the only problem. I see everything else. 
All right, I'll leave that. Skin features. Pores. Can I see my pores? Open my pores or close my pores? You know, we'll go like semi-closed. Uh, but we gotta make sure our sweat glands are open so we can, you know. Skin luster. Maybe it's gonna be like super smooth. A lot of uh, Maybelline on the skin. Yeah, we'll go like 50-50. <laughs> Doesn't have to be perfect. Dark circles, bags in their eyes. We are very tired. A very tired individual. <laughs> Maybe not that tired. But we are tired. Maybe I'll leave it in like more toward blackish. Purple makes more sense, I suppose, because it's more realistic, though. I guess it depends on how you want to play with it. I'm not going to touch any of that. Tattoos and marks. Actually, I do want to look at this. Can I leave, like, a scar? Can I move it? Tweak mark. Yes, you can. Sweet. So I can make it smaller and stuff? Okay, I do like that. Position, angle, expansion. I do actually like this. All right, uh, let me look at the rest of the marks. I have a mole. I kind of want to leave like a scar on my like head. <laughs> like the one we were just looking at. Kind of like scars. Considering I have a small one myself, it's not very noticeable. But I do have one I got when I was younger. So I'm like, any single time I get, we see like an option. Like, can I make like a small little scar on my head? Like, I want to take it. Just gotta figure out where I want to angle it. Um. Or position that I should say, sorry. Let's see. Let's go right and left. <laughs> Do you want it to be like somewhat noticeable? So now I have, I need to change my hairstyle. Now that I think about it, I never changed the. All right, I'll leave that there. We go back to hair. Completely forgot to change my hair. Alright, let's see what we have. That's actually not bad. They did a great... They, honestly, they did a really great job with the customization in this game. Now it's kind of deciding like what I want to go with. Just long locks everywhere. The Leia look? No, but close. Not really. Not even close. Um, I do kind of want something a little bit shorter. Maybe I will go a little bit longer. I just want to have my, my face actually kind of visible, but it's somewhat longer. I think I want to go like eight, like somewhere like eight and nine ish. Actually, that looks kind of cool, especially if I was going like super dark and I'm trying to hide the eyes. That should kind of suck. Right, we'll go with nine. I kind of like nine. I might change the color actually a little bit though too. Just like adjust the... Uh... The reddish that I have. Like more, or that's oh, really red. Now I'm starting to think about going back to where I was. <laughs> uh, let's see. No, let me go back to where I was. 
Maybe I will keep that. So I feel like the further right I go, I was looking for more orange. And it looks more like red. Yes, more left I go, it's more like brownish. Is there a brown? Oh, yeah, the bottom is more black, though. All right. Maybe we'll just keep what we had. I wasn't happy with the remaining colors that we had. I'm like, eh. All right. Maybe I'll go a little bit more in the white, though. Just a little bit. All right. I think I'm happy with that. Um, alter body. I gotta change my proportions. Muscular. Standard. Let's go standard. Body hair match hair. Do I have... I think I have body hair? Oh, it's a feature. Sir, you are gonna be a potential grizzly. Let's see how much hair we can go here. I mean, we're redheads. So, it's not going to be very visible. <laughs> Maybe a little visible. I'm trying to like... Switch my view a little bit. Is that visible though? I love how you like you can't even see the body <laughs> up until you get to the point of it's almost full. That's I guess that's redhead body hair for you. All right, you know what? That's good enough. I don't think I really want to match in my hair though. Maybe a bit darker. Yeah. Sure, we'll save it. <laughs> All right, I think this is good. There's our guy. It is I, Yuri, red hair, long sort of fish, more of a bandit. A little bit more higher on the dexterity portion this time around, but we'll see how it goes.
A war leading to abandonment by the greater will. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Or alone, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear, the deathbed companion, the loathsome Dung Eater, and Sir Gideon Ogmir, the all knowing. So are they all being raised? If we got that right? I figured I was going to be called Tarnished. I wasn't sure. And one other whom Grace would again bless. I guess I was. Hey, Trav, how you doing? <laughs> A Tarnished of no renown. It's me. I have no renown. Ring to and become the Elden Lord. Simple enough. I hit the game just throws a plot here right away. <laughs> oh, we're just starting. Cool. Uh this is a HUD that I have to get used to. How are you doing, Trap? Welcome on in. Is that a player? <laughs> like, who is that over there? Oh indeed. Are these all players? Hello. Weak message. Still no Elden Ring. I didn't get this experience with Dark Souls. <laughs> Alright. First off, good luck. Therefore, praise this message. Ah. Good. It's a good one. It's good. Oh, I rated it poor. <laughs> Give me a minute. I unbring this. <laughs> Bummed I missed out on the last few Dark Souls streams, but I hate that you're trying to learn. <laughs> no, you're good. Uh, I did save highlights of those streams, so if, if you ever want to go back and watch them, feel free. But yeah, no, you're a good, Trav. <laughs> praise this message. All right, let's do this a little bit better. All right, that one's praised. I think I'm trying to get used to the controls. Actually, it feels, it feels a lot better. <laughs> Bad luck for you, probably. How you doing, Greg? Still no Elden Ring. You know what? Fair. There is no Elden Ring here. Uh, what are you doing? So the path be broken and uncertain. Claim your place as Elden Lord. Pillage remains. To tarnish's wizened finger. Okay. Probably interesting going straight from Dark Souls 1 to Elden Ring. A lot more dramatic of a difference than some of the newer Soul games. Honestly, yeah. I mean, to be fair, I did play Bloodborne before any other Souls game, and then I went into Dark Souls 1. But Bloodborne, I had played such a long time ago that I don't remember much. Immediately going into Elden Ring, it's gonna, it's gonna feel different. <laughs> it does make me a little terrified because I'll eventually get into the other Dark Souls games. But I kind of just wanted to, I really just wanted to play this. <laughs> just getting started. Okay. Joy ahead. I don't, I don't believe you. I've played enough soul games, no, I'm probably gonna die like immediately. Touch Bloodstain? <laughs> I 
Okay. I think I know what this is then. So I'm guessing I'm watching someone's death here. A couple of, I can jump. Oh, that's a new feature. <laughs> that's completely new already. It's not a roll, it's a jump. Chapel of Anticipation. Alright. It's breakable. Okay. This feels great. Where are they fighting? Did everyone just run off this cliff? <laughs> That's what I'm getting out of this. I'm like, what's uh Yeah, everyone just jumped. Hidden path ahead, by the way, praise is, praise the message. <laughs> it's not hidden path. <laughs> Alright, it's funny. Okay, so that's crouch. That's crouch. All right, let's run. Yep, all right. All right, how'd you die? Did everyone just jump? Everyone just jumped. <laughs> I forgot the servers were down for the Dark, for Dark Souls playthrough. They were, so I never saw anything like this. Like I saw this with Bloodborne, but I never really saw this with Elden Ring. <laughs> the messages are so much fun. They change everything. I am ahead. Did you just want to salute? I'm not sure if I trust this, but we'll go. The door is blocked shut. How dare you troll me? So don't, don't fall. All right, camera controls. Right stick. This feels gorgeous. Look at that. Is there no photo mode? This game is gorgeous. All right. No jumping ahead. I, honestly, good. <laughs> That's a good one. I can kind of tell. All right. Look, look at all the blood stains. Where people are just like, you know what? Let me just jump. See what happens. Nope. Death. <laughs> Try rolling. Oh. Oh, try rolling here. Ah, <laughs> uh, jumping. Not a chance. But yeah, I missed all this in Dark Souls. Because the entire time I played Dark Souls, this was down. So I never saw any of this. All right, that is roll. All right. That's why. Nothing. X's items? <laughs> this is so many people just jumping off cliffs. <laughs> Hidden path ahead, then praise this message. Or praise the message. No head. No head ahead. <laughs> You know what? That's a good one. <laughs> all the messages, just so many trolls. No enemy ahead. I don't trust you at all. Actually, that, looking at that, it looks like there's an enemy ahead. <laughs> have the rings been Elden? They have not yet. Um, the rings have been uh, youngened. It's the youngin rings. The onion rings. <laughs> How you doing, Magus? Welcome on in. What's that say? Healing required ahead, therefore praise the message. That's not a good sign. I don't, I don't have a good feeling about this. Weak foe. There's definitely an enemy ahead. <laughs> too, too many messages telling me there's not an enemy ahead. Behold, bridge. Here, there, maybe the bridge is gonna collapse. First off, good luck. So really, it's gonna be that tough. I expect to die right away. First off, look carefully. Seeker the head, by the way, praise the message. 
I spend all day trying to de-soldier a connector on the circuit board. I hate that free soldier. Ooh. I'm sorry to hear that. I was going to ask, how is your project going along that you had going? Why is it always fingers, butthole? <laughs> All right. Enemy head. Raise the message, then try attacking. Game lied. Try fing. What's up with these? F <laughs> I don't mean. <laughs> yeah, I, I get that, but <laughs> I know what it means, but why is there so many of them? My project is on hold until um, I'm not mooching the neighbor's Wi-Fi. Okay. Um, I'm working on a different project at the moment. Okay. That's fair. That's one of the more prominent joke messages. Oh, okay. Praise the, praise the noon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, that's a like. <laughs> Monstrosity ahead. More than likely. Uh, where'd you go? Praise the chaos. I am just gonna go in. I mean, I don't think it's gonna go well. We'll go in. Oh uh, yeah, we're we're gonna get into something. Uh, try close quarters, uh, close quarters battle. Probably gonna go poorly, ain't it? Oh. What are you, Graft Scion? Oh, this feels so good. Alright. <laughs> just, just visually, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> I got hit off. <laughs> I got hit in. That's all I needed. Well, GG's. Well, so it was supposed to happen, I guess. So what do you guys think of Elden Ring? Oh, okay, we're back. <laughs> Hello, horse. Not a horse. No oh, horse. Don't worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. We found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. Even if it does violate the Golden Order. Excuse me. I 
I do like all like the trees and everything in this game are kind of just like very bright. So far, uh, the flask of crimson tears, flask of cerulean tears. Liar ahead. <laughs> I just like watching people die <laughs> or just saying like how they die. Let me just clarify that. <laughs> the cave of knowledge lies below. Oh, I don't trust you. No crap ahead. All right. All right, the cave of knowledge. Jump down the hole ahead and you will find the cave of knowledge. There you can learn more about the game controls and basic actions as well as other tips that may be helpful during your adventures in the lands between. So step one's to die. <laughs> Brave tarnish take the plunge of learning and remembrance. Recall the arts of war in your warrior's blood. Oh, I think they added this pop up. Don't remember that from when I played. Oh, the cave of knowledge thing. Because I'm guessing you can either just start the game or learn the tutorial. I kind of just feel like I'm going to go through the tutorial. Like it looks like I can fall there. Yeah. Like just to do it. Using items, X to use item. Okay. Um mm. So how can I fall from here? <laughs> oh, okay. We can fall pretty far in this at least. I wasn't sure how bad the fall damage is going to be. Just getting started. Uh, Sights of Grace. Resting at a Sight of Grace will restore your HP, FP, and cleanse any status elements. It will also refill your secret flask. However, most of the enemies you've defeated will be revived. You can find Sights of Grace by going to by going where light co converges. The explanations are acquired in the form of info items and can be accessed from the inventory at any time. FP. X FP, like focus points? I remember a lot of people getting annoyed that the tutorial is easy to miss. Oh, okay. So this is kind of like our campfire, blowing up our torches. Lost grace discovered. All right. Yeah. I can pass time, flask, memorize spell, sword chest. Oh, I do have a golden seed. Use a sacred tier to increase the amount of FP. With this menu, you can allocate the number of uses in each of your flasks. You can set a total number of, you can set total a maximum flask uses. You can decide how many flasks of those uses are for HP replenish and flasks of Crimson Tears, and how many are for the FP replenish and flask of Cerulean Tears. Okay. I think I'm going to leave it like this for now. Okay, I'm just going to go back. Increasing the amount replenished by flask. I do have a golden seed, so I'm just gonna use it. Why else? Okay. I don't think I have a secret tier. No. I do remember I had the golden seed, so I was like, might as well. Sword chest. So I guess I can have an inventory. Yeah. Anyway, uh, you, <laughs> with this weapon, you can place items that you're carrying into the chest for storage. And for stored items out of the chest, if you are carrying the maximum number of items when you pick up a new item, it will be stored in the chest automatically. Okay, so there's auto storage. That's nice. 
Can I give you like a mix of everything? I didn't realize I already have a bow and arrow. Okay, I was worrying. Like, can I parry with this um, plate that I have <laughs> as a shield? A head. It's waiting for the word. Like, oh, why? Enemy. Reset camera lock on, remove target. If I only had a message. <laughs> All right, so I can lock on. Can I, I would say attack or right hand or two handed ornament? Okay, got that. <laughs> that definitely feels a lot easier to do. Ah, that's another one. All right. So can I two hand this? Like, can I two hand a, they changed it. All right. Hello. This feels so good. <laughs> just the combat just feels very good. All right, come on. Could this be a lord and short seek Elden Ring? <laughs> Try attacking. Honestly, good tip. Strong hand, right hand and two handed elements. Okay. So it's. I can charge attack. Okay, parry? Oh. Oh, well, that happened. Uh, use an arm. Use an armament in your left hand or both hands to guard against incoming attacks. Guarding is especially effective when done with a shield. Guarding consumes stamina. If your stamina runs out, your stance will be broken. All right. You can avoid enemy attacks with a dodge roll or a back step. Both of these actions consume stamina. Okay. Got it. Seek south. Person fighting with a fist? Seemed like he had a shield in one hand and was just punching. <laughs> I can jump. Honestly, that's amazing that <laughs> they just had a jump, but sniper ahead. Ah, uh, warrior. Alright, do I have to watch out for someone? Hold be the dash. I think I do hear an archer. Yeah, someone is shooting. You know what? <laughs> We're going back. Oh, it's gone. No, it's still there. Yeah, that was a good tip. Oh, it's right up there. Okay, good to know. I didn't even see where that was. Like, I knew it was there. Uh, where are you? Yielding armaments. Each hand can be equipped with up to three armaments, allowing you to toggle between them. Armaments can also be two-handed, making attacks more difficult to repel with shields and boosting effective strength by 50%. Switch to right hand, left hand, wield two hands. Oh, so you have to press Y and then the button in this game? That's different. Oh, okay. I did not see that. I have an arrow on my head. <laughs> All right. Well, this is awkward. How you doing? You can... Yeah, Mike, can I parry you? I'm going to parry. Come on. Please attack. Please. 
You were like the most patient enemy. No, I'll say respect a little bit. Also, you're taking too long. Can you do something? Yeah, since there's a jump button now, they can change how two-handed weapons work. True. <laughs> okay. Wow, you're patient. <laughs> I might run from you. <laughs> I can't do anything against you. Man, I can keep attacking, but I feel like I'm just going to be breaking my weapon doing that. Now, how do I use my M's? Oh, X. Sorry. I guess that'll change it. Yep. There we go. That was actually pretty good. Okay. Pair ahead and then archer ahead. Cool. Change target. Got it. I just want to see if I can do a parry. At least how difficult it is in this game, maybe? Okay, that's bad. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I get a little bit better at that. <laughs> Wait, is that a head ahead? <laughs> Thank you. It's that archer from before. Bows. Equip the bow to fire arrows. You can equip with the two type of arrows to choose from at once. When wielding a bow with two hands, hold the left bumper for precision aiming. Use right stick to adjust. Okay. I didn't exactly read all that, but it's fine. I don't think, I was going to say, I don't know if I ever equipped my arrows. <laughs> I did. Going for headshots. Leg shots. All right, no, it's fair. I mean, he only has an arrow and it's like neck. At least it's not in your head. Like to me, in this game, compared to the first, obviously, compared to the first Dark Souls, I feel like quick weapons just feel better. No secret patch of the head, and short be wary of liar. Are you the liar? I also get like the feeling of just wanting to... No, I failed the head. I just want to like sprint. <laughs> Armaments have special abilities called skills. Skills are highly varied and range from powerful attacks to temporary effects. Use skills consumes FP. All right, so this one's just a parry. Mess that up. All right, let's just keep going. Ah, uh, pathetic sword. <laughs> I was to say crouching. I was just about to do that. <laughs> uh, crouch to make it harder for enemies to discover you, especially effective in tall grass. Attacking an enemy that hasn't noticed you will cause more damage when, than usual. All right. Let's see how we can do this. This one might actually see me. Nope. I like that play style though. This is actually kind of cool. Press RB near a back turn enemy critical hit. I'm always gonna call it visceral text. 
Is there like a way to track your movement? Probably not. At least you don't have to be directly behind them to do the attacks either. Are you ready? Like the first Dark Souls, you had to be way more precise. Praise the hole, then seek. <laughs> Praise the hole, and then seek pickle. All right. Let's see what you did there. So lonely ahead. I don't trust you. <laughs> I'm looking around. Stance breaking. Some attacks may break an enemy's stance, giving you a chance to perform a critical hit. Charge attacks and jump attacks make it particularly easy to break an enemy's stance. Hold the right trigger charge attack. Right trigger while jumping jump attack. No! How are you doing, Ace? <laughs> Ace, we're learning. Liar ahead. Hidden path ahead, by the way, praise the message. <laughs> I'm guessing these are all developer messages, maybe? <laughs> oh, the ones I always say, by the way, praise the message. How you doing, Ace? How's your evening going? What are you? Are you a statue? I don't. It did say liar head. Stakes of Marika. Upon dying, you will be revived at the last site of grace that you visited. However, if there is a stake, a stake of Marika near where you died, you can choose to be revived there instead. Oh. Do I like, what do I do? I don't attack it, do I? I'm not gonna attack it, because I feel like I'm gonna ruin it. We're about to fight something, aren't we? Try finger, but <laughs> words directly from the devs. <laughs> you have no idea how many of those messages I've ever already seen. Soldier of Godric. Is this just a regular soldier as a boss? Uh, guard counters. You can perform a counterattack immediately after blocking an enemy attack. Guard the counters make it easy to break an enemy stance. Right trigger immediately after blocking an attack or guard counter. I think I've actually done that. Oh, oh, no. Okay. I don't think I blocked that one properly. Nope. Damn, <laughs> I was trying to counter. Oh, I see the lady thing now. My inventory the jigger. I think I'm just gonna focus on dodging. <laughs> Don't really have the best shield here. There we go. Enemy felled. We did the thing. Um. Oh, I do know, although I'm closing on an ending, you can actually keep those messages. <laughs> oh, lovely. Hey, first try though, GG's. Way to go. We'd be, we be a soldier. A, a difficult soldier. So I was just talking about this with Trav too. <clears throat> And magazines and stuff, but uh, I didn't have these messages and stuff when I played Dark Souls Remastered because the servers have been down the entire time. So it's kind of refreshing to actually go back into this and actually see these messages and stuff again. Because I didn't have that in Dark Souls. Like the servers were down the entire time I played it. It's like over a month. So it's kind of refreshing to see these again. Head. Offer teacher. 
keep moving ahead. This is, I was about to say, this brings us right back to the beginning of the game. New strength. What's that? <laughs> is this status? Wait, what's this? <laughs> With stats mean you can check your level attributes based stats and more. This information shown here also reflects changes to your attack defense, the resistance bestowed by armament, armament and armor that you have equipped. Cool. I do appreciate it. it lets me know they have a medium load. Um, jokes aside, though, I do actually appreciate that. <laughs> Vigor, mind, endurance... Simple view? Oh. Yeah, everyone's kind of afraid that the Dark Souls servers are down for good. That's why I'm starting to think. It's, it's weird that they just went down and then never came back up. Oh, they're gestures. I don't do a gesture. With inventory in the menu, you can browse items you're carrying, drop them on the ground, and throw them away. You can show. Okay. I got a finger. Do you use the right messages to other. Oh. That makes sense. I was wondering what that was for. Behold, death. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll jump down this way. I do appreciate the fault damage isn't as bad in this game. Wasn't there a huge exploit with the older games, which is why they took it down? I don't know, honestly. I didn't look too long into this. Could this be a checkpoint? That's where you heard too? I honestly, I didn't even know. Also make him food, BRB? Nah, you're good. Enjoy them foods. All right, we got a grace thing. Sight, what's it called, sight of grace? We got grace. <laughs> I lost grace. All right. This is where you eat food. Um, memorize spells. With the memorize spells menu, you can memorize sorceries and incantations. You must have a staff equipped to cast sorceries or a secret seal equipped to cast incantations. Casting sorceries and incantations consume the P. Your memory slots determine the number of sorceries and incantations you can memorize. You can increase your memory slots by obtaining memory stone. Now, I always kind of do want to play with like magic and stuff. So I'm always curious how those classes work. I wish I kind of showed that in the tutorial. I'm kind of surprised it didn't. Good luck. Thanks. I'm guessing we have to go this way. Or not. All right. What do we have here? Cooperative multiplayer. Use tarnished, tarnishes furled finger. The right golden summon signs. Cooperative multiplayer will begin once you've summoned a by a player. From another world. You will take the role of an ally for old finger, and your objective is to defeat the area boss. The compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the summoner host of fingers. Wait. Okay, I mean I get the finger jokes now, but <laughs> I'm guessing the whole finger thing is supposed to be like, okay, this is where you put like the ring. I would assume something like that. If I only had a friend, Rel relatable. <laughs> Examine. You stonework key. I don't have one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it makes sense with that. I decided to get myself a flask upgrade right away. <laughs> I 
I always kind of wondered if I could just break a pot and like rubies would come out or something. I feel like there's never anything in soul games. <laughs> like the pots are just empty. They're always empty. Raise the message and then behold the secret passage. All right, you know what? Where is it? She lied to me. Why make food when you can open the bag and pack? A pack of chips. <laughs> Try, I failed. <laughs> no, I'm relatable. <laughs> Are any of these secret passages? Bag. I gotcha. Try lever. I like hit it. Someday I will learn how to type. I mean, listen, relatable. I I still don't know how to type. As I say, something got to fall on my head and kill me. This will do. What kind of look is... Alright, I see what you did there. <laughs> Alright, still no key. Praise the message Bill. I want a hidden path. Give it to me. <laughs> Developers are still a liar. Come on, Bandai Namco, get with it. Read message. Time for Elden Ring. Still no help for me. About to fight something. Oh, wow. I feel like this is like the Breath of the Wild moment. <laughs> <laughs> you see everything in the distance off bright colorful big giant Yggdrasil looking tree all right uh there is a human head this game on oh, it's later she looks beautiful There's a grace here. All right, guide of grace, guidance of grace. Grace exists to guide the tarnished and lead them along the proper path. Even now, some sites of grace retain that power. Their golden rays will guide you along the way. It's actually kind of appreciative. It's kind of like they're giving you like an idea of where to go. I don't trust that soldier down there. Uh, hello there? The map. Use your map to check your current position as well as the terrain and surrounding structures. You can update your map with new information by finding map fragment fragments at steels along the road. You can also use the map to freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks as you explore. Huh. Okay. Jesus. With the map menu, you can check your current position and terrain and buildings in the surrounding area. You can also freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks as you explore. Lastly, through your map, you can select any site of grace that you've discovered and travel, <laughs> travel there instantaneously. However, there are some dungeons in other areas where this cannot be done. Fair. My biggest map. Holy crap. Actually, yeah, it's kind of big. Well, actually, I mean, it's just one area. Yeah, All right, that's what I was worried about. <laughs> I was going to say, I mean, this doesn't look too big. They're like, oh, like, oh, okay. <laughs> it's your favorite game. Uh, I am actually 
Don't question me. I am on my Xbox. I'm sharing the game with my brother, which actually I got a text message from him real quick, so let me check. So sorry. I'm sharing it with my brother because he really wants to play it. Um... Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, Ruben. <laughs> How are you doing, though, by the way? How's your how's your week going? How's your day going? Oh yes, Tarnish, shall we? Come to the lands between for the Elden Ring. Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> Excuse me. Good, I was just playing some of this actually, taking the breather. Fair. How many hours have you put into it, by the way? Don't mind me asking. I seriously, this is gorgeous. <laughs> I don't think... What was that? I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> There's just so many things to look for. Should I shoot them? No, I'm not going to shoot them. They could be like our guidance birds or something. Who knows? That will probably kill me in one hit, I'm assuming. This enemy looks terrifying. Uh, so Spurs is telling me to go toward? I guess that... Yeah, I guess that building. Let me check. Okay. I, I just want to know if you're good birds. That's all I want to know. Just don't, don't attack me. Hello. Alright. Cool. How many trees are there? <laughs> so many trees. Wondering what the lore behind the trees are. Clearly there's something. Like we got big, big mama looking tree here. And then the, all like the smaller ones. Are there any meant for like each of them, maybe? Can I just, uh, oh. I feel like maybe I should be taking them out. Or can I just go? I don't know if it's supposed to be a Breath of the Wild ish. <laughs> should I just go so high to that knight roaming around the golden, like the golden knight over here? Just to say hi. It's probably gonna wreck me. But I might as well get my first death over with. In every corner of the lands between, you will find fruits and flowers and mushrooms and butterflies and various other useful materials. These materials can be used for crafting. Okay. 122 hours. Rookie numbers. I need to double it. Fair. You're intimidating. Buckler Perry. No, this is a mistake. Oh, you're a boss. Of course you are. Thank you, the hidden. Oh my god, you have so much health! <laughs> this was a mistake. Oh my god. Wait, did I live? Somehow.
pretty sensible. Oh, I could have attacked there. That's okay. That's yeah, okay. Only 122 hours? That that tells me I play ER too much. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, at least we tried it. I kind of figured I was going to die. <laughs> Just looking at that enemy, I'm like, look at his armor. I didn't do half bad. <laughs> Upon dying, you revived at the last site of grace that you visited. You will drop any runes in your possession at the site of your death. If you die again before reclaiming those runes, It'll be lost forever. The compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the lost runes. Okay, so they call runes in this game, it's not souls. You just have 130 today. What if I got myself into? So I guess that's runes? Yeah. They ran from me before, this will not happen again. I still call them souls. Yeah, I'm like, they're always souls. <laughs> Maybe I'll get it when it goes on sale. I'm on the wait. I'm bad enough at these games that I have no strong desire to play it right away. For me personally, I got it because I had a lot of gift cards that I was saving up from Christmas that I just never used. And then I ended up getting promotional credit at some point and it was starting to expire. So I knew I was going to use it very soon. I just didn't know when, and I'm like, I'm just going to use it now. <laughs> Alright, so that that guidance was telling me this way. Oh, it actually kind of tells you on the map. That's nice. Hello. Okay. Personally, to me, I can already tell. I mean, this is like light years better than Dark Souls. It's let me on it's on it, obviously. But uh, it feels pretty good. This may, this might be the closest to Bloodborne I've felt in a long time. Obviously, you know, similar devs. But yeah, yeah, it feels great. Church of Ella? Is that Santa Claus? Fast travel to sites of grace. Through your map, you can instantly travel to any sites of grace that you've discovered. However, there are some dungeons. Yeah, I already know that. Seek butterfly. Behold item. It's a blacksmith. I only play on the weekends, really. That's why I don't have a lot of hours. That's plenty of hours, Ruben. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Then why not purchase a little something? I am Kale, purveyor of fine goods. Okay, Ka Kale. Oh, what about you? I am of a nomadic people, selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. <laughs> yeah, probably healthier to be honest. Seriously. <laughs> Alright, give me some recommendations, Kali. You know, if you can spare the rooms, you should buy yourself a crafting kit. A crafting kit allows you to make basic items on your own. Essential, really, if you intend to survive out here for any duration. The kit costs a bundle, and I admit I do take my cut. But the important thing is that you survive. Every customer counts, after all. 
You know what? I like you now. You're honest. Also, on, also starting on Troid 4 finally. Nice. I am in that same boat where I had, that game's been sitting on my shelf forever. I just never played it. Uh, with the shop menu, you can spend runes to purchase various items. You can also sell items for runes. Each stock's a different variety. Okay. Hi, <laughs> Santa Merchant. Nomadic Warrior's Cookbook? Expand crafting repertoire. So they go really heavy with the crafting stuff in this game, I suppose. Key items. <clears throat> Excuse me. Enables the practice of item crafting. Yeah, we gotta get that. Uh, can't expand anything yet. Crafting pot. Cracked pot. Container required for crafting cracked pot items. Might as well. I can get a torch and I can get a large leather shield. Probably should have got that. Armor is not too bad. All right. That's my safe word. I don't really have a safe word. If we can come up with one. I apologize. All right. Do I have anything to sell? The answer is no. All right. I'm glad you took my warning to heart. You've made an excellent choice. I am crafting. If you have a crafting kit, you can make various items from materials that you find. Select item crafting from the main menu to make items. You can learn to craft more items by finding more cookbooks. You'll need cracked pots or other containers to craft certain items. You'll not be able to make more of those items than you have containers. Container items will run out with use, but the containers themselves will remain. Okay. <clears throat> How do we see this? Razmataz hopskidoodly do. I can remember that. All right, what can I craft right now? So I can craft, craft fire pot, roped fire pot, bone darts, row of raisins on horseback, feed the torrent to restore. On horseback uh, shines with a colored light when placed serving a guide reveals co-op and hostile summoning signs all right so I can't really craft much right now skip boobop at a smithing table, you can spend runes and spitting stones to strengthen your armaments. Somewhere in the lands between, you may meet a blacksmith who can make armaments even stronger. Right, let's see what we can do. Uh, with the smithing menu, you can spend runes and smithing stones to strengthen your armaments. You can strengthen your armaments up to plus three at a smithing table. Somewhere in the lands between, you may meet a blacksmith who can make your armaments. <laughs> they really? Really want you to say the word armaments. Even stronger. Okay. So that makes my equipment better. Cool. Guess I'm gonna go this way next. I'm just gonna follow the light. This is actually kind of uh, a little overwhelming. Okay, that's an enemy. I didn't mean to do that. Time out. 
Neither were any to fix that. <laughs> I'm just trying to get used to the controls because I feel like B should be kind of like a duck. And clicking my control six should be more of a run. But I know like soul games is usually B anyway, but it's just our brain's thinking otherwise right now. Kind of want to be stealthy on this. Oh god, there's a couple of them. God, you go. God, I gotta stop doing that. <laughs> Buttons make me think crouch. Buttons don't make me think heal. <laughs> All right. Uh, can I change this some better? It's heavier. That's okay. I don't like that. Th I don't like that word. My brain keeps wanting to say armaments. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll figure it out as you go. It was overwhelming for me too. I just go ahead and do things all the time. <laughs> My brain's making me think like all the buttons where they're being placed right now. It's not making me think that's a heal button. It's making me think that's a crouch button. Ah, crap. Ah, well. Let's <laughs> do it again. There's a couple soldiers here, that's why I'm a little, a little worried. It is Series X. I think this one's gonna be a little bit easier. I think I've already done more critical hits in this game than I have done in all of Dark Souls. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Warrior head. Alright. Uh where's the there? Right. It looks like there's something coming up ahead. Little boar. Snozzles. What was this? I only get one just at, uh just so I have all the all the sonsils. I gotcha. There's some more of them. I wanna get those raisins. Where are they called again? Gold tingled in increments. Okay. Row of fruits. Oh, they're like raisins. Um, here, maybe we can be sneaky here. Nailed it. What is this? Got a rune fragment. This world's so big. Oh, there's like a village up here. Something up here. Oh, 
mushrooms. Why y'all gotta make me kill animals? Uh, I went bandit. I don't know if I'm gonna stick with it. <laughs> we'll see how the game goes. Last time my class changed drastically as I went. So checkpoint, why is there a message <laughs> on top of the checkpoint? <laughs> this better be a good message. This would be something about like buttholes probably. I can't, can't read it. <laughs> There we go. Still no arms. No, I'm just gonna give it just for the placement. Oh, this is not village is bad. All right. It's, I gotta say the open world aspect actually works very well with Dark Souls. Like vibes, like soul games. Dragon the head. Um, but yeah, I went bandit. Cause I, don't know, I thought it looked cool. <laughs> That's why I kind of went last game. Last time I played, I also went to a similar class. I was bandit. There's one right behind me. Oh, I didn't see you there. Hello. Your friend's dead. I'm amazing. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hi, I am truly back with food. Welcome back with food. I got Perry. Uh, I went with the guy with a lot of faith. I don't remember the name. You must have had a lot of faith, though. <laughs> yeah, I was to say, you must have had a lot of faith in that character. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not really. I was very proud of that, actually. <laughs> also, Ruben, I have this for PS4 now, so we can play together. Ace is just going to have, like, 500 hours on, the, uh, like, all consoles, and I respect it. Off her head. <laughs> Off her my blade. Oh, poor samurai. <laughs> 500 hours each console, thank you very much. I'm sorry, did I not? Did I just say in total? I, I apologize. I think I want to use a shield this time around. I don't know. I think the one thing I know for sure this time around, I don't want to use a two-handed blade. Even though they're awesome. I want a different play style this time. Wait, what's this? Strong foe ahead. Up there, maybe. Guess that's where all the light's going. I think I'm gonna kill all the soldiers first, if I can. Gate front ruins. I did finally be one on my own. One on my own though, that was pretty cool. Nice. That's just your improvement, man. Oh, poor guy. Demons here coming. All right, where well, I grow you out of the way. Come yeah, on. I love the uh, vision. Are you, do you not see me? Wait. No, I think he definitely sees me. I guess not. Oh, I'm gonna go stab you real quick. EFB, how you doing? Oh, 
shield. All right, let's change this up. Uh, can I equip this? Oh, I don't have enough strength. Nope, can't equip it. All right. I'm chilling, watching stream. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. I've had a good, uh, had a good day today. Played a bit of Animal Crossing today, which was interesting. I did not expect to do that. That was fun. I'm going in. This is probably, he's probably gonna turn on me before I get the chance. You are strong. That's not good. Okay. I was gonna say you are strong. That is the enemy I should have taken out last. I'm gonna kill you real quick. Oh, there's a wolf. No, a wolf. I'm so sorry. I hide. Oh no. <laughs> I might be in Viz. I'll let you know next time I hop on there. Oh. Okay. 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 Live it. Live it. Just, just us two. Make it fair. Oh God! Don't make it fair. Don't make it fair. Let me make it fair. What? Oh, that doesn't heal enough. All right. I think. I know what I need to do to beat you. I just don't think I'm going to be able to do it. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> the idea was to parry. <laughs> I, I did not parry. Is we had an old fashioned you died screen, so that's kind of nice. Actually, you know what? Choose revival point. Uh, America. Um, so what do we got right here? Move myself down a little bit. Is this okay? Try that. <laughs> so I don't want to be blocking everything. I'm also oh, this is a mistake. I wasn't paying attention. That's okay. Maybe. <laughs> My shield is cute. Thank you. <laughs> My cute little bandit shield. It's more like a. It's like a hat, like a helmet. I do feel like I like the stealthy approach though. Like this kind of, kind of reminds me of like the more, like the newer Assassin Creed's. A little bit. But definitely better combat. That's uh, good, it doesn't cover your souls. Okay, thank you. All right, let's see if I can. Hmm. I was kind of wondering what their kind of like their view is kind of like. Oh, well, that, was, that sucked. <laughs> All right, let's get you over here. <laughs> oh, no. That didn't hurt too badly. All right. All right, can I point out a thing? No spoilers, spoilers, just a game setting thing. Um, Go for it. You can tell me. Uh, but what did we say it was? Razzle Dazzle, Jimajiggy, Jimajiggy, Jimajigger. 
Razzle Dazzle. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> yeah, it's a safe word, Trifinger Butthole. <laughs> yeah, go for it. You can tell me a thing. Treasure just ahead. Oh, hey. What we got? Lord's, Lord Sworn's Great Sword. Good tip. Razzle Dazzle. Da -ba -da. Five is right out. I'm trying to think of a tree ahead. There's a tree ahead. Just something in the tree. I cut the tree down. No. Be wary of dragon. So you prefer to have your HUD on all the times, like we did in Dark Souls games. There's a setting in the systems menu where you can permanently keep it out instead of just when you're in battle. <laughs> yeah, that's actually fair. Let me... I think I'm going to keep it off just for the time being. I know what you mean, though. I think I'm going to keep it off for a little bit. I kind of, I kind of like not having it on. I kind of just wish that they kept the item inventory on, on the bottom right, like that all time. Well, then again, mm. <laughs> now you're making me second guess. <laughs> it's a valid point. <laughs> Let me think it over. Oh, I forgot about the sleeping soldier. Just making sure you know you have the option because I messed up a little in the beginning. Not sure if the game tells you that option. It did not tell me. I can tell you that much. Uh, you can turn, 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 turn. Please. You know, wait until the other, other soldier. Uh, screw it. Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> I'm like waiting for you. Like, let me get my best roll attack in. All right, critical hit. Game's like, nah. <laughs> Not today. I want to take that one out. Uh, this is the big soldier. It's going to have something good. Smoldering Butterfly. I didn't read it. <laughs> Map. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god, it's so much better. A new map has been found. Cool. Does this tell me landmarks? Maybe landmarks I've never been to? Nope. Just landmarks. <laughs> That's nice, though. Game doesn't tell you Jack Squad. I learned everything from Google. <laughs> yeah, there is a tutorial, but the tutorial is just for like some basic combat stuff. And like a, I guess, tutorial boss. I don't know when you turn. I'm going to wait. Yeah, this does feel a bit Assassin's Creedy right now. So I'm like hiding in the bushes. <laughs> It's like waiting for one of them to turn around. Did they really walk into the bushes? Really? You see me? Alright. I know you're there. Bring it on. Ah, crap. <laughs> I wonder if I can be a little sneaky, stab the guy, and then run. I'm glad at least I know I kind of got an idea what the field of view is kind of like now. So I gotta be careful of that soldier. All right, go. 
I might take out the wandering ones up there first before I go after you. I think I missed those last time. And I think there's a wolf here as well, if I recall. Oh. Yeah. Ah, screw this is going. Yeah, you're dead, you're dead. Let's run. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to outrun the wolf, but I can at least lure them. that ah crap I'm in trouble don't really have the best setup for these guys especially two of them all right I'm gonna go <laughs> I just run from them. I need to like fix this. What was that? Never mind. <laughs> Alright, I think I got away. Uh it's like I wanna fight them. I might be better off not. Let's go on. And I can always come back. But I could get something really good. <laughs> like, I want to take... Why is there a horse? But I want to take that one out. Oh, I should probably grab this, though. So do the enemies revive the moment I sit down? I would assume yes. Or we get a cutscene. These are our safe havens. What are you doing to me? Look at that girl again. Greetings. Hola. Traveler. From beyond the fog, I am Melina. I offer you an accord. Is she one of the ones they mentioned that were revived? Have you heard of the finger maidens? They serve the two fingers, offering guidance and aid to the tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are maidenless. I can play the role of maiden. Turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. You need only take me with you to the foot of the Erd Tree. I think it's a pretty good deal. Then it's settled. Summon me by grace. To turn runes into strength. Ah, another matter. I bequeath to you this ring. She proposed. All right, spectral steed whistle. Use it to traverse great distances. It will summon a spectral steed named Torrent. Torrent has chosen you. 
treat him with respect. <laughs> if you refuse, the game ends and deletes itself. Does it really? Honestly, I would believe this game actually would do that. Though. <laughs> this game being like, oh, you said no to the maiden. All right, good luck trying to beat the game at level one. How many people you probably think are like, yeah, we've said no and played the game at level one. <laughs> it's gotta be a thing by now. Shall I turn your wounds to strength? Yes. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. All right. But the level. With the level up menu, you can spend runes to increase your attributes. With each attribute increase, your level rises by one. As your level raises, so does the amount of runes required for the next attribute increase. Makes sense. All right. So I'm guessing this is for health. Uh, there's a help button. Explanation. Okay, perfect. A cumulative figure that represents overall attribute strength. You can level up using runes. Um, let's see. Attributes governing HP also affects fire resistance and immunity. Attributes for FP also affects focus. For governing stamina also affects robustness. This attribute also determines how heavy your equipment can be. Uh, attribute required for required to wield heavy armaments. Also boost attack power by strength, scaling armaments, and affecting your physical defense. Okay. Uh, tribute required to wield advanced armaments. Also boosts attack power of dexterity, scaling armaments. Reduces cast. Sorry if I hit the mic there. Um, reduces casting time of spells. Often softens, softens fall damage and makes it harder to be knocked off your horse. Dexterity is really important in this game, huh? That's a lot. Uh, uh, tribute required to perform glint, glintstone sorceries. Also boosts magic power of intelligence, scaling sorceries, and improves magic resistance. Uh, tribute required to perform secret incantations. Also boosts magic power of faith scaling incantations. Governing Discovery also affects Holy Defense, Vitality, and Certain Sorcery Incantations. Okay. Thank you for that. Uh, that's all really important. The left. What's left right now? <laughs> Okay, so my right hand is my dagger. <laughs> my left hand's my weapons. I feel like I want to get strength up at least just by one for now. Just to have that at 10. Now I'm also like. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just trying to figure out how I want to play this. Equipment load's always going to be important. Like endurance is very important. Dar da darker? Uh, dagger, I hardly know. Darker? So what does uh, strength exactly do? Besides just attacks? Required heavy armaments. Also boost attack power, strength scaling armaments, and affects your physical defense. Mm. All right. I will up a one to strength for now. Just to have it up to 10. Um, I think that's really it. All right. Thank you, doll. By doll, I mean like. Bloodborne, anyway. Um, you use a special steed whistle to summon and ride your spectral steed. If your spectral steed dies, you can summon it again. Okay, thank God. But it will cost one. Oh, no. It won't cost one flask of crisp tears to do so. 
You can dismount any time to whistle again or pressing. All right. Cool. Uh, oh, your guy has high dex and arcane. That's what I want to do next playthrough. Nice. <laughs> See you. Uh, from pouch in the main menu, you can equip six items to your pouches. Four of those items can be used without opening the main menu. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Okay. How can I call my seat again? <laughs> I didn't read that. Um, I need the whistle. My whistle. So how do I... Trying to figure out how to put it on like my quick menu. Maybe equipment, probably. Yeah. yeah. All right, that makes sense. Um, let's. Remove, I want to put it on this one. Also, Ace, I think I'm going to use your uh, advice. HUD on. Yeah, it's a little bit better. Now this is a Souls-like. How you doing, Malik? I think the more I looked at that, the more I'm like, you know, I think you're right. I think I do want that on. I do like the idea of having less clutter on my screen, but I don't remember the controls well enough right now where I want it off. I am all faith and strength on my current playthrough. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what I want exactly. I kind of want to go a bit more decks. Like, I want to have a sword and shield. Maybe. But I also kind of want to try out magic. I didn't try out magic before, and I kind of want to try out magic this time. So I don't know. All oh, right. Um, try horseback. Horse battle? That's so cool. During mounted jump, double jump. I can double jump. Wait, so how do I get off again? Left. Okay. So I'm going to make sure our steed doesn't die. Underlay! Such a kind of goal. It moves very well. I primarily Dex, Vigor, and Mind. I'm still not sure if I like it 100%, but it's still fun. Because that's the thing, like, I want to try something different compared to the last time, and I already put something into Strength, so I'm off to a great start. Be wary of Giant. Oh, I didn't even see you. Oh my god! <laughs> you know what? You can go. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's, get, let's get a little back here. I feel like you're gonna kill me in one hit. My god, you take like no damage. I'm gonna die here. <laughs> oh, that giant. <laughs> Seriously. Can you like, uh. Leave me alone? <laughs> I don't think I can fight this thing. I mean, I probably can, but it's just gonna. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Yeah, I deserve that. Having the open the <laughs> abomin abdomen reminds me of abominations from Warcraft. <laughs> See that? <laughs> ah, I keep getting stepped on. That's my weakness. It's the, the feet keep crushing me. Keeps going for like a grab. And then that. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Wait for the swipes. Attack its hands. Ooh, 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 ooh. Is this like I do a thing there? I felt like I could have done like a critical attack. Are you blocking this? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Think for I mean, could use arrows. That's a bad idea. <laughs> Actually, maybe a good idea, but not a good idea right now. I feel like it's gonna be a things like I'm gonna beat you, but at what cost? I ain't halfway dead yet. <laughs> it's just like Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Seriously. Did I go too far out? Yeah. Oh. I just missed all those attacks. <laughs> nice job. You know what? I'm gonna go roll front. Actually, it might be a better idea. I just missed all those attacks. <laughs> Attack on the wrong leg. That's a mistake. Oh well. I cannot fight this leg right now. I felt like I had a good strategy going, and then it just it just fell apart. Of course. Now what? Is that like a trap? Wait, is that another dragon? Wait. Got a flower. Uh, it's like a... <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Thank you. What is that gr great sword for ants? It's getting up mad. Toupee can't go all shadow the classes? Seriously. Oh no. Can I make you trip? I don't know. <laughs> as soon as I started, I let go. I'm like, oh no. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like, don't even swing your sword. Like, you're, you can just easily crush me. I mean, we did pretty good. Oh my God, just keep. <laughs>
I might go level up. Thank you, thank you. It's like Breath of the Wild. Too bad you can't go all shock classes. But it's, yeah, I felt like it was like a great story, like its own little like dagger. <laughs> I feel like if it had a great sword, it would be like the size of its body. <laughs> I would not be able to avoid it. Quack to you too. That was fun. I probably just revived it, but it's fine. <laughs> um, considering I have daggers, I feel like I should probably stick with. Um, dexterity for now. I mean, I do have a sword. I actually, back up. I kind of forgot. I do have a sword. I don't know if I want to use sword. I probably do, but... The long great sword. I need 16 strength. So it's like all these weapons, like I have the dexterity for it. I don't have the strength to use them. But I don't know if I really need it. Like if I can just find more dex weapons, maybe I just want to focus more on dex. Like screw the long swords and stuff. Claw causes blood loss buildup. Didn't even notice I had passive. Didn't even know they had passives. So you know what, maybe, maybe I will just focus on decks. Phase armaments, boost attack power of dexterity, scaling armaments, reducing casting time of spells, soften damage, okay. Maybe I will use this for now. I should probably get a little bit of endurance maybe at some point too. Can I reroll my stats at any time? I don't know. I'm thinking no. Dexy is sexy. Dex, dex, dex build confirmed. Let's go. I don't know anything about dex, so it's different for me. Guess we'll just learn as I go. Hopefully I can find something. That's is it gonna come back? What have I done? <laughs> I can't do this again. Okay, am I supposed to use my steed and just run? <laughs> That's what I'm kinda getting to the point of. Also, is there a boost? Oh, it's probably B. Who am I getting? Yeah. Indeed. Jump over these. Oh, okay, just run. Just run through them. Makes sense. Oh God! <laughs> Alright. Is this behind me? I don't see it. This is fun. <laughs> I'm a little nervous to try a dex build. So I've never tried one, but it's also exciting. Uh, I don't know. I don't know where to go. So many places. Just gotta follow the path. I was about to say, did I just drop a new alert? Wait, what is this sound? I know the wolves can get kind of just revived through, uh, well not revived, but summoned through wind. Vanquishing enemy groups. Vanquishing enemy group replenish your flask. The number of type of flasks will replenish varies depending on the enemy group. You cannot replenish more flasks than your maximum amount. Can I use my flask real quick? Damn it. Sir Robin ran away. <laughs> he bravely ran away. I forgot I still have that command. 
I need to uh, get rid of the, right, the Pokemon one. A Sir Robin, the knight who bravely soiled his armor at the Battle of <laughs> Bods and Hill. <laughs> Love that mechanic. Actually, I kind of do too. Let's you explore so much more. Um, God, I don't even know. That. I don't know where to begin. It's just so much. They're all kind of telling me to go this way. I mean, the gate's telling me to go this way, so I guess just keep following the path. I also kind of want to explore these buildings. What mechanics? So when you get into a fight, like a group of enemies, and you kill them, they'll actually revive you. They'll give you more flask. Yeah, they'll refill your flask. Which you don't get that in other soul games. <laughs> That's brand new. I've never heard of this. But I do like that option. It's a little bit more lenient, like, okay, here's a deal. We're going to make it a little bit more challenging for you. And if you can actually succeed in this challenge, we'll reward you. Which is, I like that. That's nice. What is that? Might be another uh, light. Yeah. It's a lot of graces. Do I even get that in Breath of the Wild? That's true. Oh, there's someone in there. It feels like a trap. <laughs> Anytime I see anyone, I'm just like, it's a trap. Oh, we got a stone sword key. Sweet. It's a bonfire. Can I save here? No tarnished head. Like a new gesture. Uh, I have a story that heals me when I kill someone. I love it. That sounds awesome. <laughs> Sitting sideways. All right. I do have a question. How do I do gestures? This this can be answered because I kind of want to do. Like I get them. I'm like, how do I use them? I know it's going to vary depending on like controller use, but kind of curious. Well, this has to be like equipped. Praise the tower. All right, cool. Use a touchpad. You know what? That is fair. It could be like select maybe. I forget that controller has an extra button. If only I had a corpse. I'm gonna ask. Oh, there's a bunch of soldiers. Permission to backseat a small thing regarding NPCs and the like. Permission granted. Uh, Razzle Dazzle, Shimmy 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 Ha. I think that was our uh, thing. I was actually just thinking, I'm like, I should probably talk to them again. <laughs> oh, they were on the right side there when you press start. I do see them there, I just don't know what the command is. They usually have more to say. It's a little red running hood. <laughs> Not sure if you did that in DS. I did do that. I did find, I did find that out later. I was kind of thinking about like, you know, let me just double check. Can you take this little one along with you? 
Spirit jellyfish ashes? With a spirit calling bell, you can use ashes to summon various spirits. Summoning typically consumes FP. You can only summon one type of spirit at a time. You cannot summon spirits during multiplayer. It was a pleasure to see you. Oh, can you pass on a message for me? If you see the little chrysalids in Stormvale Castle, tell them I love them. And that, despite my craven heart, I'm sure I'll be joining their club soon enough. I'm finally getting the hang of this whole pain thing, you know? Yeah, she's just giving up. I just want to be like everyone else, but I'm too scared. <laughs> Oof, too real. That is fair. What do you use on the PS4 controller race? Uh, how does this work? Number held. Wait, Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell. Use to summon spirit jellyfish, a flowing spirit that illuminates the surroundings, prone to tears. The jellyfish girl searches for her distant home, will bravely spew poison on foes on their summoner's behalf. It seems her name is Aurelia. Aw, it's kind of cute. I haven't even started Elden Ring on PS4 yet. I just got the game last week. Also been very distracted by the PC file. Very close to an ending, I think. Uh, okay. <laughs> Isn't it really an actual Gannets of Jellyfish? I don't know, to be honest. There's so many soldiers. I love how you go to kill animals and sheep. Thinking you're gonna get like flesh or meat or something like that, and you just get bones. <laughs> you don't even keep the meat, it's like, ah, it's just bones. <laughs> I might have to climb the rocks. Is it though? I actually don't know. It is? Alright, that was intentional by them. It's a moon jelly. Should we try it out here? Can I try it out here? Oh, it won't let me go. You can come. Oh, Diagra, one of them. Never mind. Should I just fight them all? Let's get it over with. Oh, for crying out. That worked. <laughs> I got one at least. That's actually kind of good timing. It's actually kind of cool though. I had no idea. So in order to summon them, I know I need FP. I didn't realize if they were stored. The was there of 600 HP cost, FP cost. So it has FP cost. 
Thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> that's, all, that's all I gotta say. <laughs> Uh, okay, let's go, let's go over here. Okay, checkpoint. It's kind of nice. What is that? No, get over here. You're probably something really good. I didn't realize. No. You will not run away from me. <laughs> Give me like 5,000 XP or something. Adding skills. With a wheatstone knife, you can use ashes of war to grant you armaments, new skills on sites of grace. An armament can only have one skill. Any skill it previously had will be removed. An armaments type determines what skills it have. Some special armaments have unique skills cannot be okay. Adding affinities. With a wheatstone knife, you can use ashes of war to grant affinities to your armaments at sites of grace. This way you can alter an armament's attack affinity. Boost attributes scaling and more. An armament's type of determines what affinities it can have. Some special armaments like those with unique skills cannot be granted new affinities. Ash of War. Oh, hi there. <laughs> yeah, it skills. Those trees are really wibbly wobbly. It's too real. I'm just looking over and I'm like, oh, hi, soldiers. <laughs> One just casually shooting arrows at me. <laughs> Alright, relax. Yeah, I'm gonna follow the shadow over there with the other player. Gotta be a little sneaky. As a couple of them are attacking me. I see you there. Get out of here. <laughs> Trying to sneak on me. Oh wow, I didn't realize you had that. So wow. God, how many soldiers are there? It's not good. Oh, you son of a... <laughs> Alright, I might have to fall back. On Dasher. Is that? Oh my god. <laughs> it caught me off guard. But I didn't want to do that. Wrong thing. Heal. Thank you. <laughs> okay, well, peace out. <laughs> Are those skulls? Ow. Can I break them? No. Oh, yes, I can. Golden rune. <laughs> Thank you for that. Alright, so I can go around it, I think. Am I around it? Yeah, I am. Hello there. Yo. Dick. Can I use it? I would like to use it. Well, I gotta go. Let's see how they're following me. <laughs> Sweet. You look safe. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Oh, I'm like one. Actually, no, I got a thing. What are they called? Rune somethings? Golden rune. I'm using some small number of runes. All right, let's see how much I get out of this. 200. All right. Should I just keep pumping my <laughs> dexterity up? So it gets my stamina up to 97, my equipment to 49. So what's our key give me up exactly? Discovery? Discovery and defense. 
So what's this? Wait. Covering discovery also affects holy defense, vitality, and certain sorceries and incantations. All right, I think I'm gonna get I level up my dexterity again. I think I'm gonna stop leveling up after that for a little bit. Offer life. Behold behind. I don't like all this blood. What is this? Summoning pools. In each area you may find effigy, effig effigies of martyrs. <laughs> these things are summoning pools. <laughs> You'll find it easy to summon other players at these locations. As co-op and hostile summoning signs created with small, these things gather at summoning pools. Yeah, these things. <clears throat> small golden thing. That key item? No, it's just an item. Are you about to fight something? <laughs> Am I gonna summon? Yep. <laughs> Foul tarnished. In search of the Elden Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Lim, Margaret. Gasp indeed. <laughs> Margaret the Fell Omen. Okay, you're kind of strong. That's actually kind of sick. that can I cut your tail off or can you fall off a cliff <laughs> I kind of feared your tail so you like a weakness eat yeah I'm dead How are you new, friend? <laughs> oh, we'll get there. So I'm thinking... I might update my flask. <laughs> Death. <laughs> I'm thinking I might update my flask a little bit. Welcome to most people's first wall. Oh, hey there. Forgive me. I've been testing you to see whether or not Grace truly does guide you and whether you are fit to face the challenge that entails. It seems my worries were unfounded. Torrent had your measure from the very start, whereas I merely pretended. There is but one other thing I can do to offer you guidance. I can take you to the round table hold, gathering place of tarnished champions. 
guided by grace. Very well. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. I'm having a chill Saturday. Noise. Uh, whenever you get a chance, what level are you at the moment? I think I'm level eight, if I recall. I'm on Xbox, by the way, as you can tell. <laughs> uh, the round table hold is a place where the tarnished gather guided by grace. Combat is prohibited on the premises due to the pact of non-aggression. This rule is in effect when the round table icon is displayed. Round table hold is located outside this world, but vast travel by grace is the only means for reaching it. Use map to travel there. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to Firelink Shrine. That's what I was just thinking. Something like Firelink or that uh, temple in Bloodborne. It's, it's the HUD of the world. It's always a HUD. Rest of the table of the lost grace. Oh, hi there. Oh, I see you just arrived. Welcome to the round table hold. I'm Corin. Hey, Corin. Man of the cloth. I teach incantations, the strength granted us by the two fingers, and explore the secrets of the golden order, so that one day, if a tarnished of the round table hold should become Elden Lord, I might counsel them, ensuring order regains its proper form. Writing rule over men. By the way, do you still see it? The guidance of grace. I see it. You do. Wonderful news. Most tarnished are blind to it these days. You are something of a rare breed. Well, what do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? Yep. Yeah. Oh, so this is where I can get magic? Heals a small amount of HP. Heals HP for self and nearby allies? Huh. Okay. Increases magic damage negation. Fire damage negation. Throws fire. Throws ball of reaching fire. Sick. So I need faith. Most of these you need faith. You don't even need intelligence in these. Momentarily sparks flame from hand. Throws fall of raging fire. Produces a shockwave that pushes foe pushes away foes. I feel like I need a thousand to get urgent heal. I actually might use magic this time around. <laughs> This is what I use. I can see why. Yeah, I can definitely see why now. Oh, I'm level nine, by the way. I'm looking at that now. And faith weapons. I can definitely see why. Elevates poison buildup and cures poison. Magic damage negation. I want to use fire. <laughs> All right, I gotta save up some ruins then. There's a lot of people. Is that Marth? Or no? Who are you? What? Ah, hello. You must be new here. I'm, well, just call me Dialos. The honor of one's house holds little import in these lands. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant, but fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. If you find her, please be sure to tell me. Lenya? Definitely haven't found her. Offer, don't give up. This say is telling me to walk into the fire. There's intelligence magics too, though. I don't use those ones. Okay. Come for the head. My goodness. Are you the Dark Lord of. <laughs> uh, what's his freaking name? Lord of the Rings. <laughs> oh, I can't. I think of you right now. <laughs> it's the helmet. It's the helmet that's getting me. Oh, this is a rare occasion. 
sound like him. Can't remember the last time a new tarnished made their way to the round table. Very well. As your senior, Saren. Sauron. It is safe here. You may let down your guard. <laughs> Grandpa. Grandpa Sauron. <laughs> No, that's fair. There's nothing left to say. Be at your leisure. Sis? Keen ten eyeball? Never mind. Thanks, Grandpa Sauron. Did he give us his name? Never mind. Further study of incantations, is it? I can happily spare the time. I forgot. The golden order. You're just a shopkeeper. Be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman named Lanya. She's a servant to my house. She's been my companion since childhood. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to find her like this. Honestly, she's such a little tomboy. Be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman named Lanya. She's a servant to my She's been my companion. Right. I've lost count of the number of times. Honestly, she's such a little. So Lanya the tomboy you gotta look for. Someone in here. Praise the Erd tree and then praise his message. <laughs> praise the stars. Uh, hello there. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> All right, fair. All right, oh, well. good talk. Are you alive? Huh. Whoa. Grants a blessing of an equipped great ruin upon use. White cipher ring. When invaded, request the aid of a hunter. Answer request for summoning of hunters. Increase memory slots. Okay. And these are just like weapons. Nice. Dagger slash pierce. I'm trying to read the weapons a little bit better just to make, I need you. You're more dex based. Okay. Shimitars, rapiers. Those are the type of weapons we're gonna need. Impaling thrust. Or spinning slash. I want. I think I want the shimitar. Even though that sounds cool too. But actually, this might be better. I don't know. I have options. All right. Well, can't get anything in regardless. I think I'm gonna need to like grind a little bit. Because I can't. A, I can't buy anything, and all the souls I had left were left with the uh, boss. Um, weak foe ahead. Say one now. Jumping ahead, and then good luck. Then why are there so many blood stains? There's a weak foe. Yeah, I don't know. No, I don't trust that. <laughs> Could this be a monarch? I mean, don't get me wrong. I, I do kind of just want to jump down and see, but no. <laughs> weak foe ahead. I don't trust it. <laughs> All the blood stains. As soon as I see them. The amount of blood scenes, like, not a chance. Raise the message. All right. Open. Okay. Door is black shot. Fair. I just look at. The I 
just want to read the message. Too, too high up. You know what? Fair. Do it. Okay. Should I? <laughs> Can I? I feel like I'm just going to jump and fall. That's going to kill me. There's got to be a staircase. <laughs> I do want to do it, though. I won't, I won't do it. <laughs> do I want to? I kind of do. But I feel like one of these doors are going to lead to it at some point. It's locked right now. Sometimes problematic to wear shorts at a urinal at a bar. You know, it's steak. That's fair. Also, how are you doing? Also, how's your souls? How's your Animal Crossing? How's your everything? You have zero souls, nothing to lose. I left my souls over at the... They're fighting something down there. And that guy just died. <laughs> I just saw a soul die. I kind of want to ask why, Stig? But also, I'm a little concerned. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I do have some souls I want to grab. So how many spells can I memorize too? All right. Um. Uh, yeah. All right. That's fair. So where was I at? I guess here. When you feel someone else's fair. You know what I asked? That's all I needed to hear. I, I know enough now. Thank you. <laughs> all right. So here's the deal. I could fight. I could try to fight this boss again. I don't think I'm prepared is my problem. I can try one more time, but I think I need better equipment. I don't have very good equipment right now. I'm still using basic equipment. <laughs> this is why I don't go outside. Um, I feel like I still have basic equipment. I need to get better equipment and maybe level up a little bit more. But I think I need to just get better equipment for the most part. We'll try, we'll try one more time. I'm, I'm probably going to lose, but we'll try again just to learn like it's tactics so you know it's battle style oh no <laughs> I don't think I should need to stand that's front or the back. I think I want to stay on the side of it. So if I get to... Ooh, okay, I wasn't ready for that. Oh, yeah, I wasn't ready for that either. <laughs> you know what? All fair. He's got to with his tail. Alright. Jump off a cliff. <laughs> The bars are inside and the urinal, so it's less the tree. 110 runes, don't question me. So let me try my thing. That sure wasn't too bad. Oh, I'm good. Alright. So yeah, 100% I need to get better equipment. I'm dodging them really well. Thank you. I think my problem is I'm just too weak right now. <laughs> I need to grind a little bit. Probably go back outside all those enemies I kept skipping <laughs> and actually kill them. And then probably use those souls to get some better equipment. But I definitely need to get better stuff. Why am I good? Well, I don't know. It's just natural. 
kidding. Um, oh. Oh, fuck. Alright, so I can kill you. Ah, crap. <laughs> Why did you die attack? I'm actually just trying to learn the parry as well. To be fair. Let's do some practicing. Nope. Nope. There we go. Learn to do that better? That'd be great at this game. Nope. It's too early. That was not even... I wasn't even trying that time. Some greaves. Don't know if I can use them, but we'll take it. I think it's because he's fresh out of Dark Souls One. That could also be another thing too. We'll go with that. I never got parrying down. It was so much easier in Demon Souls for me. I I've already done probably more parries in this game than I have in all of Dark Souls One. <laughs> Dark Souls 1 to me pairing was impossible. Or I just never practiced it enough. Yeah, that great sword. Oh, I'm out. Oh. <laughs> Didn't realize that. I think I parried through the four small enemies in Dark Souls 3 and one in Elden Ring, and then one in Elden Ring was next. <laughs> Oh wait, where did I just revive it? That's fun. We'll get back. He said, "Group password. You'll more likely to see messages, summoning signs, and blood scenes and phantoms from other players using the same password." I feel like you can get really trolly with that. Like if you know for sure there's a group of people that will post horrible messages in a specific group. Password. Or maybe like groups of people that are actually be helpful, like one of the two. I hate you. I don't think I need to be in this area. <laughs> Not right now. I want to grab my souls, but I also, it's going to kill me. Actually, on second thought, let me do that real quick. I need to avoid the turn. Toot toot. <laughs> doot doot da, doot doot. Oh, that's a horrible spot. All right, we get off you. Kill you. Grab this. Uh, where are the uh, soldiers? Oh, there's one. Oh, well, there's two. I think I want to save it for... I'm going to go for a better weapon. The passwords in this make it so much easier to summon friends. Oh, really? 
So I'm gonna be for friends or for messages and such. Okay. Take these guys out. <laughs> I like the one like looking over like wait a minute. <laughs> And they're all like, nah, it's fine. I feel like I got parrying down for those enemies. I don't have them down for these enemies. Or I meant the, uh, any other type of weapon, like a spear. Swords, I can kinda, like regular short swords. I kinda have that down. Also, this thing in me was just travel back. Can I just, can I just fast travel at all times? Cool. <laughs> I was just thinking that I'm like, I can fast travel anytime I want. That's that's actually kind of nice. How's it already ten o'clock? Sorry. I was just looking at <laughs> looking at my time. All right, so I just want to see if I have any runes. Best part. Time. <laughs> oh, fast traveling. Yes, agreed, 100%. Wonder if I can even do it on those enemies. All right, you two can come. We're just like both trying to counter each other. All right, I need like another like 50. Don't need much more. Game skipped all the BS and just lets you fast travel off the bat, you know. But I mean, considering how well, like open world this game is, I, I do appreciate that. Oh, for crying out loud. That's my fault. Oh, I have enough. Yeah, I thought that was going to be a problem. Dude, the Great Smith terrifies me because he can just, I know he can kill me instantly. The Great Sword, I mean. Yeah. Horizon Zero Dawn, you need a travel pack? Yep. Yeah, the Horizon games, you always need those travel packs. But you get to a point where you can just go to like a bonfire or something like that and just free fast travel. But the problem is actually having to get there. But I get that. All right, let's go to the mall. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go back. We'll buy a weapon. I think I'm gonna get the rapier. I think it just depends on which dex weapon I prefer to use. I can always get both and maybe just practice. 
I do want to get magic though. We'll, we'll get both. <laughs> I think weapon would be more important first and then I can get whatever else I need. Uh, let's see. Shimitar stand, standard pierce, dagger slash pierce. That's a slash. All right, so let me try reading this correctly. Shimitar is a little bit heavier. Does more damage. I'm kind of just looking at the cost of the weapon, and that's what I'm judging. <laughs> I'm like, ah, oh, rapier right, costs more. Obviously, it's going to be better. Actually, it is more dex. Um, yeah, I'm going to go with the rapier. Can I get this armor? Trying to see if it's worth it. Can I compare? It also costs a lot, so maybe I won't go for that. What are these? For old fingers trick mirror. Take on the appearance of a host of a... F Take on the appearance of host of fingers. Take on the appearance of cooperator. It's weird. All right. Thank you. Uh, you. All right, so I got a new sword. So this is the thing I'm looking at as well, because it says FP cost. Oh, uh, it's for my skill. Nice. All right. I'm good. All right. Um, cool. So I need another thousand, I think, for the healing. So I think I'm going to do that. Those last two were for multiplayer. Uh, okay. Makes sense. Stand by. <laughs> My dog said hi. says hi here oh you want to say hi okay. go say hi no <laughs> like nah not today Oh, that's high. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> oh, hi. Yeah, she was, um, uh... I guess she just woke up or she probably went out before bed. Uh, did I get a new mic? No. This is actually my same microphone. I put a, uh, whatchamacallit, filter on it. <laughs> just so I stop some of like, the popping sounds that you might hear before. To me, I could hear it, but there were like popping sounds that you could hear. That, it bothered me. 
And typically this microphone I had has a built-in one and it worked well for a while. I guess it's starting wearing out a little bit or it's just not as good as I thought it was. So I got rid of it. Oh. Oh, okay, I got used to this. Definitely killing them faster. That's early progress to me. <laughs> Alright, what did I get out of you? Bolts. Okay. I was kind of hoping I could somehow use this. Praise the message and then fire. All right, it's praise. Let me fire it. <laughs> I swear these guys are trolls. <laughs> I want to shoot it. Or at least roll it down a hill. <laughs> Take them out. Looks off. It really is. Now the thing that's really good about it is that it gets rid of a lot of those type of sounds that make your microphone sound a little bit too poppy. And overall it just sounds better. Really. Like truthfully. Oh, it's beautiful. So beautiful. I'm liking this. Alright, let's get you over here. Ah, crap. Oh, you lived? When HP in a dream on you. Alright. Alright, 100% buying this weapon is the right decision. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna try to beat this first boss before the end of the stream. I think that's kinda my goal right now. I feel like I can do it. Yeah, helmet. Oh, hi there. It's another one. I'm glad you like it though. I'm glad it looks good. Going through these guys, seriously. Damn. <laughs> All right, so these are ruins. It's like more stuff. It's like 200 in each of them, which is nice. He's for early game. It's nice. I got a little jump rabbit. Get over here. Give me your bones. I'm sorry. Gave me nothing. Nothing but sorrow and grief. Back with snack and coffee. Welcome back. What kind of snacks did you get? Also coffee. <laughs> what kind of coffee did you make? Do it. Do it. <laughs> I want snacks and coffee. Do it. Dragon oh dragon. It's 9.30 too late for coffee. It's never too late for coffee. I mean, it could be too late for coffee. Don't get me wrong. I have wheat thins and yes, coffee. I'll allow just some instant coffee. Okay. 10.30 here. Yeah. <laughs> like it depends on how late you want to stay up. I think if you had to pick any day to have a late night for coffee, Saturday would be the day. I just have water. Dragon, he's nuts. <laughs> Please. Look at all this blood. It's beautiful. Just all that color. Really just jumps out now. You select a number. Alright, let's get some healing. All right, actually, I could do one of two things. I could get some healing or I could level myself up. Let's get some healing. I want to go shopping. 
again. I'm just scared of ruining my sleep patterns. That is actually also fair. That's literally, yeah. <laughs> That's completely fair. I'm actually kind of excited for a deck spell, I'm not gonna lie. Ah, you appear to be doing well. Very good. Thank you. Well then, would you like to learn an incantation? Yeah. Uh, I could use fireballs. Oh, I need more faith. <laughs> I have no faith in myself. All right, catch flame. Momentarily spark flame from hand. Now I kind of want to use, <laughs> kind of just use fires. <laughs> I think fireball and healing. May the golden order shine through you. <laughs> Your coffee is broken. Coffee makes me sleepy, so maybe don't follow my example. <laughs> Borkin. All right, so how can I equip? Tables. Uh, Grace. I've never done this. So this is new to me. Whoa, that character looks sick. All right. Look at that hair. All right. Um, cool. So we got that. How, where are my stats? How much faith do I have? Eight. So we get. So if I level up my faith by two, it gives me the 10. Then I can learn Fireball. <laughs> George Michaels. <laughs> Do we have a George Michaels command? We don't. On Stig's behalf, I have to say George Michaels. <laughs> if you do want to make a George Michaels command, feel free. You don't have to. Uh, I cast word can tell. I <laughs> gotta have faith. <laughs> All right, when frost gauge, frost gauge is full, you will take damage to become frostbitten for a while. While suffering through frostbite, you take increased damage. The higher your robustness, the longer it takes for the frost gauge to fill. Okay. Color message. <laughs> Loud noises. <laughs> All right, so I have faith. Or heal. Or I guess I can use it because I don't. Oops. There we go. I'm trying to remember my controls here. All right. So I need to clear through these enemies again. I can go back. Suck it. Godric, I'm just gonna, I don't even need armor. I just keep coming back and killing these guys and they give me stuff. Um, it's just the weight I think I'm a little worried about. <laughs> I have faith. There you go. <laughs> I still want to get too heavy. I think I have. Looking good, I guess. I'm a bit sturdier now. Like so close to killing them in like a couple hits. Oh no. Yeah, I'm like, that's gonna kill me. <laughs> like very quickly. Tree and beast circo? Oh, I have that. Never mind. 
This command is my enemy because I have a hard time spelling Michael. <laughs> Sir. Yes. Sir. He stabbed that man in the face. He deserved it. It's either my face or his face. Oh, oh. Okay. I'm kind of having a good time grinding her. It's actually not that bad. Keep finding like the runes here as well. Then just visual strike. Oh wait, those skulls. No! <laughs> I need my skulls. Oh, I didn't even see you. Hi. Definitely stab that one in the face. Right in the butt. <laughs> Alright, so I have enough to level. Bacon decaf. <laughs> Get it. Yeah, enjoy that. You know the one thing I have not done? I haven't done crafting. Bone darts. Throw the enemies and inflict damage. Shine a color light when places serve as a guide. The horseback feed the torrent to restore HP. I think this might get a port in the bike eventually. I, I I appreciate so much that it tells you if if uh, your equipment loads too heavy. I God that bothers me so much in um. Dark Souls, because you kind of have to figure out like your your entire like equipment, like weight class on your own. Like you you know you hit a certain number and then you're like, okay, I can't get past that. At least in this game, it tells you, like, hey, if you go this way, your equipment's gonna be really heavy. So you might not want to go equip that. Like that <laughs> changes so much. You kind of like the percentage better. I didn't even. I, that's the other thing though. There's no percentage or anything in the first Dark Souls. You just get a weight. That there's no indicator in the first one. So I'm guessing at least in like two or three they at least tell you, which is nice. I'm fine with the percentage as well. But like there's not a single indicator in the first Dark Souls. Yeah, there's nothing. It's just it's just a weight number. That's all it is. <laughs> Dark Souls 3 spoiled me then. Yeah, the first one you you don't get that. <laughs> like, at all. Wait, hold up. Um, I want a level, I think. I think I want to level up my faith? Gives me more fire. It gives me magic and fire. But I think I want this to 10. I kind of want to get fireball. But I don't feel like I'm going to need it. Maybe not right now. Endurance might be a little bit more important, maybe. Or vigor. Or technically, wait, thinking. <laughs> I'm thinking like defense. Endurance gives me fire. Kind of just playing around with everything. So strength actually gets my defense up. If I get it to 11. I 
I am gonna put up faith. Give myself a little bit of faith. You know, we'll give this another try. We'll see how we do. I just want to see progress. That's all I want to see. Get my 110 souls back if it's still over here. Ow. Okay. <laughs> Great progress already. Okay, there was some progress there. I got one hit. I think I got one hit or two hits. I do consider that progress. We had 85 runes. I will say this is actually a tough boss. Again, again. <laughs> Yeah, that's a lot better. Oh, I should have seen that coming. And that. And this. <laughs> and that. Will you like chill for two seconds? <laughs> Balls is ridiculous. All right. Definitely need to, they still need to get health maybe. Surprisingly enough, I feel like I don't, like I don't need endurance. I do just want to get fireball for the sake of getting fireball. Like, just to have it. <laughs> just burn me. I'm not sure how I feel about fighting on my steed. Like, I could try it. See how this feels. Actually, it's not that bad. <laughs> Oh no, uh, that was bad. I'm a little reckless here. All right, get off of that. <laughs> it's like I was helping at first. Not anymore.
Oh. I didn't realize we were finding the group of enemies kind of thing. Getting the special items. For a moment there. Hello, persons. Welcome back, person. How you doing, person? You guys are gonna wonder if I could go somewhere else, but I don't I think you can get past this. Mm, where's the thing about your gear? Never mind. Oh no. <laughs> that was horrible. <laughs> It's actually kind of nice. I got a decaf and an uncrustable. <laughs> nice. I ended up um, failing to manage the amount of food I eat today. I definitely overate for dinner. <laughs> I can tell you that much. It's always pizza, man. Pizza is my weakness. So like, you give me pizza, I will eat it. And then in my mind, I'm like, I should probably stop. And I'm like, ah, I can have like one more. Sit down. <laughs> What's your pizza order? Uh, today I just had, um, I just actually had cheese pizza today. But, um, I do like a meat lovers. I do, uh, mm, pepperoni. I do like to do you like a pepperoni. I will say I am. If you want to unfollow after me, I'm just saying it's totally fine. I am a supporter of pineapple pizza. I'm not saying it's my favorite, but I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's fine. But I do like my pineapple. If it was an option. Um, and then, God. Yeah, pineapple goes with everything. Thank you. I go pineapple, jalapenos, and black olives. That sounds delicious. I'm a mushroom and sausage, no cheese kind of guy. You and my dad would get along very well. My dad loves his mushrooms. 
Oh, oops. Lactose intolerant. That's that makes sense. Yeah, my friend. Ooh. I like pizza, but I do not like spinning from 1 a.m. to 4 a.m. in the bath. <laughs> Did you not see me? Interesting. BRB? All good. Pizza gives me the worst heartburn now. I hate being in my 30s. I get, um... I do get, like, if I eat way too much pizza, for instance, today, um, <laughs> I do get a little bit of heartburn, but, I'll, like, it's really bad as a reflex. I think that's the worst part if I have too, too much, which... I'm gonna sleep great tonight. <laughs> I already have a lot of souls. I will get you birds. Wah! I got one. All right, so I already have enough for fireball, but what if I can just kill these enemies too? Let's go back. I think we have enough for fireball and maybe like a level up. You know, I have not used urgent heal once yet. <laughs> Keep telling myself I'm gonna level up enough and get the urgent heal. It's been great. I haven't used it. Every time I look I have full health, so it's like I don't even get the opportunity to use it. Oh wait, I can just teleport. What am I doing? I think it's my problem. Like every single time I think I have to go back to this place. Um, I'm thinking about using a grace to travel back. I can just manually do it. Okay, so what can I get here? Fire, fire sling. I think that's the one I want to use. I don't think it what this is. Momentarily sparks flame from hand. Is that like a close quarters kind of thing? So I feel like this would be a lot better. So you're just throwing it instead of snapping your fingers. Guess I could get both.
Nah. I use the other level up. And also with you. Ball better, yes. No riding areas. Cannot enter large buildings, caves, catacombs, or similar spaces while on horseback. You also cannot summon your horse while inside such spaces. That is rude. Some interesting load screens, I'll tell you that much. Do I need a staff to actually use this stuff? I just thought about that. I thought I could just use my rapier. Wait. Much as a staff. <laughs> like sitting here for the longest time, I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I wish I knew for a staff. Uh, okay. See, I'm not familiar with the magics. <laughs> I'm just kind of hoping I could just use it and then... Can you tell me a thing? Give me one moment. I can't get a staff here anyway. Um, finger seal. Wait. Uh. Um. Yeah, go ahead, Ruben. You can tell me a thing. It's a finger seal for incantations. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I just realized I'm like, oh. <laughs> Staff or something else. I think I got that now. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, it kind of just clicked for me. I was like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> I could probably... I kind of wonder how much damage it's going to do, though. I'm very curious. <laughs> Alright, so I can use them both. Okay. Oh. Alright, you gotta be careful there. Alright, so if I'm just like, hey, fireball. <laughs> it's so cool. Yeah, my guy starts with one. I didn't realize. 
that not for everyone. <laughs> You memorize sorceries and can incantations at sites of grace. You must have a staff equipped to cast sorceries or a sacred seal equipped to cast incantations. Casting sorceries and incantations consume FP. That's sick. I think my problem now is I can't really parry with my current setup, but it's okay. I, mean, I can still go back, I suppose. Like, if I ever wanted to do that, I could still do it. Depends on the fight that I'm in. Okay, I think I got a build that I want to do. We are doing magic now. I'm actually kind of excited. <laughs> I didn't do magic in Dark Souls. That's why I'm like, oh, this is different. <laughs> I thought you don't want the archer bow. I feel like I'm gonna save the fireball. Uh, oh, screw it. Just gonna keep going. <laughs> I'm digging the dex build though. The more I'm using this, the more I'm, I'm really liking it. All right, I'm gonna use the fireball on you. Goodbye. Ben. <laughs> it's so much fun. Magic is a lot more fun in this game than Dark Souls might be in for many different options. So how does healing work? It's like when Lancelot charges in the castle on Holy Ground, the other guards yell, hey, <laughs> he charges past. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna wait to use my heal. I'm a little concerned right now due to, oh, whoops. Um, I just want to try out my heal, that's all. Oh, I didn't see it. Oh, there's one behind me. Crap. Alright, let's try this out. What was this take? I didn't even heal that much. Alright, hold up. That heal was not very good. I think it really depends on just the type of magic I want to use. But I do like so far what I have gotten to use. Oh crap. I didn't have my shield out. It's like, oh no.
Okay. Yeah, it's definitely been a little bit of a grind, but it feels necessary. What I'm trying to think right now is what I want to do next. So I do feel that I need to level up some stats. I'm just trying to think what I want to level up. I still feel like endurance is going to be very important. I don't think it's very important right now i do think i need more attack like strength for our decks i mean sorry um i do feel like i also need health <laughs> it depends depends with what i want to go with um i suppose if we keep leveling up faith it's gonna level up my magic and everything like that anyway Or not. Kind of really want to get this up to like twenty <laughs> for some reason. I just don't know how much. All right, I just want to know how much health I'm gonna get. Have you used a figure? Back from cutscene. <laughs> Welcome back. I got a little bit. Hope you had a good cutscene. It was an interesting cutscene. <laughs> what game? Electronic Racer. Oh no. Like I mistimed that. All right, you can come over. You know what? Screw it. Fireball. <laughs> it's so much fun. <laughs> oh. I didn't realize I could charge that. That changes everything. Well, I missed that. That's my fault. I feel like based on what I'm doing, I'm still not strong enough for this boss. Oh crap.
Alright. I deserve that. <laughs> So if I hold the heal down longer, I'm probably going to get more health, correct? That's what I would assume. But it just takes longer to cast. Hold down fireball, get a bigger fireball, fireball done more damage. <laughs> yeah, they're going to see me here. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's go back. See what we can get. I know you can get one level. I might actually just I might focus on dexterity. Oh, this will help. That's the other thing. It's like every single time I go for these runs, I usually find like one or two of those skulls. And it's like an extra two hundred, which is nice. another one I think I see another one up there couple of them wow that's a lot if I can hit it <laughs> yeah I feel like this is gonna roll off yeah I kind of saw that coming I think I couldn't hit that. <laughs> okay. So we got more. Um, let's see, that's what I got. Another thousand? Eight hundred, I mean. Math. It's difficult. I didn't realize it's after eleven. Alright. Let's do two dexterity. I just wanna get let's get my dexterity to twenty. Or I want to at least take these enemies out a lot quicker. If I can start taking these enemies out quicker, I'll feel more prepared. Or at least comfortable fighting uh, the boss. That's better already. Come on. I can definitely tell why people people can consider this the first wall <laughs> in the game. Oh, whoops. Now. Ah. A 
Okay. So I'm getting him in like four hits now. So that's different. Uh, let's have some fun. Let's see. Kill you. Bye bye. Really? Magic does feel very nice. And to be fair, same with the other games. I haven't tried them out, so I can't really say. But at least in this one. There you are. Can do leggings. Um, this is too heavy. I burned the birds. Yes. Which makes me wonder. So I didn't realize that was a big AOE there. Like how much damage you could do on these guys. Really? That was really weird. Alright, well, I mean, it worked. <laughs> I was very confused why they're just standing there. <laughs> it's like they didn't see me. Alright. Well, that happened. Um. I think how different this game feels just by adding jump. Just a simple little button. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go level up. I don't quite have enough. I want to get a 20. That was my goal. My uh, dexterity. I don't even have enough to get a one. All right. Well, one more run. One more run. I think we'll be ready. We'll give it another try. And then I'll, if I fail, I'll probably go to bed. <laughs> Didn't realize it's so late already. Well, I mean, again, it's a Saturday, whatever.
If you needed any hints, let me know. Yeah, I'm good right now. I appreciate that. I'm good right now. I do feel like I for sure needed to level up a little bit. I just love doing this. This is why I love doing this. This is so much fun. <laughs> I don't get how they don't see me. That's the part that's a little weird. It's kind of broken. That's why I keep missing. I can take this one out. Then I can take this one out. And then only have to deal with the one. Instead of dealing with two. But then I get to this point and I'm like, okay, hey, look, fireball. <laughs> but you actually black countered pretty well. At least that one did. Even the birds here. Like a fireball. I love magic so much. <laughs> I do like the Dex Faith kind of build. I, th I might. I think I'm gonna be sticking with this. Magic so much fun. Oh yeah, dagger. Just a regular dagger, but it's a dagger. The only thing I can really actually no, I don't even need that. I am thinking stamina I will need. Because my equipment load's gonna get a little uh uh whatchamacallit. A little low. And I'm gonna get in heavy armor. If I keep giving those heavier armors, I'm not gonna be able to equip them. If I'm not moving the way I wanna move. Ever. Yeah, sneaky, sneaky. I like being stealthy. I like being able to stealthy get the like, those like critical hit, critical hits, but visceral attacks, and it it's satisfying to me. Then I think I played enough Assassin's Creed to, to feel this. <laughs> Damn, I need one more. I am getting to the point where it's taking a lot of runes a little up. That's how I know for sure <laughs> that I'm getting close to the point of, okay, I can probably take on the boss. Is when I keep attacking enemies and killing them. And the game's like, hey, you're gonna have to do like two or three runs now to get at least one level up. Instead of like one level per level. You know what? 
Let me try this real quick. So I hold this. Nope. So heals you can't hold. They just give you whatever. Fireballs you can hold. <laughs> So I'm not going to do an entire run this time. I just want to get at least up to six, like 1700. Level up and then give it a try. Also, wow. Oh yeah, this guy has no shield. Ammo. I was just thinking about that. I'm like, wait a minute. I can just burn you. <laughs> All right, I can do like two more of these. That's enough. Unless I get attacked here. Nah, I'll just kill you anyway. There we go. <laughs> it's just it's too much fun. Also, the AoE you can really go with that fireballs. Tent. I don't think kill. I don't know. Okay, so this does help with fireballs and stuff. Good to know. Dexterity actually helps with fire. That's interesting. I'm going to have so much decks. <laughs> All right. Let's give this a try. Um. I think I'm gonna use I'm gonna use fireball. I do have one cerulean tier. So if I need to re like redo it, at least I can redo that. But I don't know I don't know how helpful it's gonna be. Oh god, here we go. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot better. much. I mean, I'm still getting, still getting hit. Oh, I forgot about that. And that. All right, let's try this out. Okay, he was prepared for that. <laughs> now. That didn't do too bad. Oh, I keep forgetting about that. It's that second strike. Oh, I think he's got me that time. That's fine. That was better. What I need to learn is that pattern when it does the long attack. That's what I need to counter a little bit better. Because I need to remember he does a s swipe and then like another swipe from behind like immediately. I don't prepare for that. But I mean, it was progress. I definitely did better that time. Let's try again. And also, literally appreciate that it's right here. I don't have to walk like five minutes down the road. I don't know. <laughs> Not gonna get greedy here. I will get greedy to grab my souls. Or runes, but... Ow. 
Jump off the cliff, please. <laughs> Definitely doing worse this time. Okay, so... Rolling backward really does not help much. I do feel like there's gotta be a way like expert parriers probably you can probably like parry those attack and then counter it. That's gotta be difficult to do. I refuse help. <laughs> where are my souls? Hey, where are my runes? Well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Who needs runes? It's only like a hundred. <laughs> That's my speed run. <laughs> it's pro strats right there. I had to beat the boss real quick. Just roll off the cliff. I was kind of curious if we can actually hit that in the air. Or if I could somehow stun it. Margaret. If I could somehow stun Margaret. I wonder... I'm going to say I think Fate's kind of useful. For this fight for me i don't know i'm kind of thinking of ideas of maybe learning to parry it with my shield and see what happens like when it's more up close like here maybe not there yeah you know what in second thought He's a parry. <laughs> I just want to jump off the cliff. I think that's what I wanted to do. To use the other Dark Soul bosses, just accidentally killing themselves for my benefit. This game's like, no. <laughs> Back to the old fifth tactic, because we can't parry. Damn. I almost got the, almost got that second dodge. Oh hi.
I do wonder if maybe I should be coming back here later. No. Maybe. <laughs> Why are you walking around with two giant sledgehammers? Holy crap. <laughs> that was awesome. Actually, I just thought about something. I'm gonna die here, but I just thought about um, using my rapier attack for magic. Impaling thrust. That's what I was thinking of. I wonder if I could use that, maybe. Let's see how much that does. Otherwise, defensively, I'm in trouble. <laughs> that second attack is impossible to dodge. Also, I did nothing. thinking right now I'm thinking maybe I should not be here that's what I'm thinking <laughs> the enemies are weak and I can kill them great but I wonder if this is my intended path I actually dodged it that time All right. I mean I'm doing damage My problem is my defenses are horrible. That's my only problem. I have no defense. I'm too offensive. I'm gonna try a couple more tries. And then maybe I'll actually one hit. I just can't dodge that. Like that? <laughs> that AoE is ridiculous. I heal. Oh, that was bad. That was dumb of me. I'm not gonna lie, this might be tougher than any Dark Souls boss I fought personally. <laughs> I think this one boss in particular is harder than anything in the first Dark Souls game. At least that game I could learn. I think at this point I'm getting to the point of I probably shouldn't be here. That's my mindset. And there's probably maybe another path I could take. I just can't dodge that second one. That's my problem. Amongst other things. <laughs> That's my main problem. <laughs> It 
still there, Ace. I'll take a hint. Just, just one little hint. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking maybe I should be leveling up better. That's what I'm currently thinking, but All right, here's the deal. Here's my hint. Or here's a question I actually have. Should I be going somewhere else? That could properly help me a little bit more with this. Or should I be here? In your opinion. Because in my mind, I'm thinking right now, maybe I should not. I was level 18 when I beat him, and I was told I was very underleveled. LOL, that is your hint. If my mini flex. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what level am I right now? I think I might be 18. I'm 16. All right, thank you for that. <laughs> also, flex. that second one I just don't get how to dodge it he does a stupid whips that I can get out of dodge oh that's a waste music. Oh, actually, maybe I do get another good. Maybe. It's kind of hard. <laughs> I think I might actually understand how to dodge that. So these combos it does. Oops. I meant to kill her. Yep. Well. I'm with the other way. Okay. Right dodge, left dodge. That's how I have to remember that one. That was better. Uh, exploring could be good and fun. This game has a lot, allows a lot of freedom. So just have fun with it. True story comes second. <laughs> Jesus boy. <laughs> Grill them, slap them between some bread. <laughs> Margaret sandwich. Speaking of George Michael's show coming up. a George Michael show? Wait, what? <laughs> really? I have another confession, friend. What's up? You're no fool. Okay, so right. Left. 
All right, I don't know how to dodge it. <laughs> I thought I had it. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> you know, I could actually have curiosity. Like, how much does this do? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> That's a waste. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> I just throw a dart. 28 damage. <laughs> <laughs> I bailed on the boys. They were chatting with, with some girls, and I didn't. Hmm. I could be home drinking tea, so that's where I'm heading. Thought mobile Scarbo. Fair. Honestly, sometimes you just need to be home. <laughs> just have some you time. I get that all the time. Just needing me time. I may get attacked. What am I doing? Finally! I learned to dodge a combo. I get to the point I think my dodging is just spam roll. All for the best. <laughs> Which sometimes it does not happen. <laughs> sometimes you just roll off a cliff and then you know, you know, life happens. Also, I agree. Uh, I'm not a fan of. Are you talking about Twitch Mobile? Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Takes so long to swing. I'm like, no. <laughs> Panic rolling is punishable by death. Fair. A festering bloody finger. You can enter another player's world. God. I have to think of the analogies for these things. I think no. <laughs> they have to know. Swipe. Close enough. rolled the wrong way. <laughs> I don't even think I even rolled that time. <laughs> I was like, I'm getting ready to roll. I didn't roll. Hmm. I do. I have one idea that I want to try. When it does the charging attacks, that's when I want to try it. Failure attacks, I'm going to mess it up. But I want to try parrying. Ah, crap. <laughs> the heavy attacks. Like these. It works! Okay. I can't 
can't get a critical hit on it, though. That's my problem. Because that's gonna fuck me up. <laughs> hey, good news. At least that works. Yeah, have a good night, Trap. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. Trust me, we're about to probably go to sleep myself. too hard. This. So say I got lucky there. Thank you, Trav. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate that. I got a parry. So like I feel like the long winding attacks, I can kind of time it. And I can get a parry off. If I have fireball. I gotta like switch between shield and magic, which I'm getting rid of that. So that's all I need. Gotta get up early yourself. I think we're gonna do like one or two more tries. I'll probably sleep on this. Problem with me, it's like at the moment it starts getting those combos off. It's nonstop. <sighs> Alright. When you carry more than 70% of your maximum equipment load, your dodging roll becomes slower and clumsier. If you exceed maximum load entirely, you become able to roll at all. Okay. ready for that. <laughs> it really got my health down that time. Ah, crap. Jesus. It's like non-stop with these attacks. Alright. <laughs> I think I do need rest. I think, you know what, Margaret, I think you have the right idea. I do need rest. I think I'm going to take the rest. Been going for, what, five hours? Yeah, I think that's, you should probably call it there. Yeah, I think we will. So let's switch over. But no, this is, this is fun. I mean, it's fun when I'm playing nonstop for this long. If I can play this long for a game, nonstop, I'm having a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap here. So if you're still here, you're still lurking, you're still playing, you're doing whatever you gotta do. Um, thank y'all for being here. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, Ace. Thank you, DFB. Um, Trav, if you're still here. Welcome to the addiction. Yeah, thank you all for, thank you all. Seriously, thank you all. I really appreciate it. Um, I'm not going to raid. I'm actually going to go straight to bed. I'm kind of just going to ready to collapse. Uh, we'll be back with more Monday. We'll do more Elden Ring on Monday. I might just be streaming this going forward for the time being. It's like, I want to dig, I really want to dig into this. That's about it. Thank you all. Thank you all very, very much. Ace, Trav, 
Steak, DFB, Lama, I know you're here earlier. Ruben, thank y'all. Um, seriously, everyone else here, very much appreciate it. Magus, one day you will get this game on PC and we can play together. <laughs> we will. 